All right, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to find missing terms of arithmetic sequences. Uh, there's a lot of methods out there that are really mathy and really kind of convoluted, and it's disappointing because I think it's a very simple topic, so I'm going to do the best I can to keep this as simple as possible. Uh, suppose the sequence below is arithmetic. Uh, what I'm asking you to do is find its missing terms. So I start at negative 5. I have three blanks. I have no idea what goes in there, and it goes up to 39. Well, since it's arithmetic, I know what I'm going to be doing each and every time is adding d, which we call the common difference. So from negative 5 to the first missing term, I'm going to add d once, and then I'm going to add it again, and again, and again. So basically what's going to happen is I'm going to have four d's, four common differences. And from here, I know that if I start at negative 5 and I add 4 of those common differences, I'm going to get 39. Well, this sets up a really simple equation, and really all we need to know here is what our common difference is, which we call d, and we have the problem pretty much solved for us. All right, so I have this simple equation here, and I just need to solve it. So obviously, negative 5 plus 4d, I'm going to want to add 5 to both sides, which means 4d is 44. Divide both sides by 4, and d is 11. So now we know the common difference. So if I take negative 5 and I get to that first space, I need to add 11. And negative 5 plus 11 is 6. And then to get from 6 to that next space, I need to add 11 again. And that puts me at 17. And to get to the next space, I need to add 11 again, which puts me at 28. And just to make sure, I'm going to see if I need to add 11 from 28 to get to 39. And I do. So I know that my final resulting sequence is 5, 6, 17, 28, 39. Um, I hope that this kept it simple and straightforward. Uh, I wish you guys the best of luck on the next flurry of problems.